I must say, thank you so much for inviting us here. You know, we, we are really excited about this project because something we feel very strongly about is, is really wanting to educate children about good, healthy food. And we think that's so important, so we're delighted that uh, the school have decided to give us a chance because I really do believe we can show those children. It's part, as I say, of, of general education, even down to, you know, perhaps table manners. Absolutely. It isn't just about the food, it's the whole package, and that's what we feel we can offer. Well, you're going to meet some of our Dubai British School um, students and they're going to be talking to you about, you know, what they enjoy. Yeah, that so would be great, range, actually. 15 of them. To see what's going to entertain them, what they'd really like to eat, and we'll just keep fingers crossed that it's already on the yes, menu. <laughs> <laughs> well, good luck with them. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. You know, we just wanted to know, sort of, what food really, I say, pleases you? What kind of thing that you'd really be looking for? Because when you have a school meal with us, mm. we don't use any additives at all. We don't use any food colorings, nothing like, nothing that. like that. What you know you're eating is 100% fresh. You know, children are very keen to dissect food if they don't know something, and obviously it's opening their palate. But one of the things that we've been um, quite keen on doing is almost grating vegetables into the food. So for like instance, the cottage pie or the Cornish pasty, for instance, you'll get sweet and parsnip and fresh carrot grated within that and of course they don't realise they're actually eating three vegetables of vitamin C and vitamin A and uh, you know and it's, they haven't got the facility to dissect it as such. If we want to give you a nice cottage pie or a shepherd's pie you know every single item in there has been freshly made and like I said organic if we can get it and good old-fashioned mashed potatoes which is delicious and for me that is about healthy food for children they're getting good something good and solid to eat almost going back to our good old school good old days, days and our school meals, which I loved. Yeah. We're also adding another dimension to your, your school lunch where we're going to have an organic salad bar. And you can help so yourselves. You can then go to that salad bar and help yourselves. Yep. So you've got lovely little organic, you know, cherry tomatoes and sweet peppers and, you know, little lovely cucumbers and you can make your own salad. One of the parents came to us and said how, how wonderful it was that their child now ate fish and they'd never eaten yeah. fish before and refused it. Yeah. However, after the school meals and the fish pie and the little croquettes that we do and the little fish cakes, they absolutely adore they it. Love and them. that opens their palate, yeah. opens their palate. And, and it works very well. And as we said, with desserts, you know, you, they do need that little touch of sugar. It gives them strength. So, you know, and we try and keep that, again, where possible, to use natural sweet ingredients. It could be something like honey. If you were going to have a dessert, what would be your, your favourite favorite, what yeah. would be your favourite dessert? Cheesecake. Oh, yeah, cheesecake, yes. yeah. We're featuring cheesecake yes, as well, aren't we? We are definitely doing a cheesecake. Nice lemon cheesecake and a raspberry cheesecake, yeah, I believe. Yeah, that's right. We also keep portion control right. So if you're going to have a dessert, it's going to be just that nice little taste. It's enough, enough to give them some energy for yeah, the day. Yeah, that's it. And that's what we want to do. We want the children to be happy. We want them to look forward to lunch. That's what eating is all about. I'd like to think that one day we're going to have these children who are going to stop conversation at the table and saying, have you tried that yet? You know, oh, that is so alive. It's yep. packed. We want this to become an experience, to become a social gathering. It is trying to make it an occasion lunch. It isn't just to scoff away on food and think, right, that'll do. It's to hopefully want to look forward to the next day's meal. So you as all friends together in this family style service have got great communication across the table and maybe just now and again in that conversation the food gets mentioned and if that happens we'll Makes be happy. Us happy social interaction is a really vital important skill that we need to teach our our kids you know that ability to look a person in the eye and and listen this should be part of edu uh, the uh, of the curriculum quite simply and purely because it's something we have to do for the rest of our lives and i like yeah. what you said about it being part of the curriculum yes. it's part it's an important part yeah, of the school nice. day yeah. and i'm very keen to make it an enjoyable healthy and worthwhile part of the day nice. yeah. yeah we have to eat so let's do it well Let's do it uh, so we can enjoy it and understand flavours that we're actually eating. So, yeah, I think it's definitely going to work. Definitely, definitely.